This is a tomato plant. I'm growing hydroponically. It's about three months old and it's unremarkable as far as uh, plant quality, fruit quality, or uh, nutrient solutions I'm using. What is different is the container I'm using to grow it in. Let me show you what's a little different about this setup. What's different about my setup is that instead of a standard hydroponics grow pot, I use a 10 gallon aquarium I purchased from Walmart for just a dollar or two more than the equivalent pot from a hydroponics store. What makes this so entertaining is that the roots actually grow much faster than the, uh, the green top of the plant that we normally watch. And in so doing, you get a bigger appreciation for just how aggressive some of these plants grow. It also shows the differences in, in uh, the root types. For example, my first uh, experience with hydroponics was in growing melons. They grow roots that are lighter than water, so they float and only require a basin that's about four inches uh, deep. Deeper than that, and uh, the roots don't extend down. This tomato plant, on the other hand, the roots are heavier and tend to fill the entire container. Another thing this taught me is how much room the roots require. This is a solid mass of roots in a 10 gallon uh, aquarium. So you have to think that uh, for circulation reasons, so you don't get uh, dead spots in the nutrient solution, that you want as much space as possible for the roots. I would think this 10 gallon is a minimum for a tomato plant of this size. I would actually much rather go to a 20 gallon. Anyways, whether or not this is a good idea or not is incidental to the fact that it does make growing hydroponically more entertaining because now you have two parts of the plant that you can watch growing. I hope you found this interesting and we'll give it a try. Thank you for watching.